Back in 1881, when the railway first began, giving service right across the Isle of Newfoundland. Construction moved so slowly as they built the narrow rail. So the story of the bullet is an interesting tale. Memories of the new fee bullet rolling slowly down the line. Memories of the new fee bullet catch forever on my mind. Now on her maiden voyage, June of 1898, she left from St. John City with passengers and freight. As she went rolling down the line, the trip was a success. And 27 hours later, pulled him to Portobello. Memories of the new sea bullet rolling slowly down the line. Memories of the new sea bullet, it's forever on my mind. Neil served in the dining car, we're off the highest class. Tables dressed in snow white cloths, china and real glass. Conductors, porters, engineers, cooks and stewards too. Try their best to make it an experience for you. Memories of the new feet bullet rolling slowly down the line. Memories of the new feet bullet itch forever on my mind. For those who rode the bullet, they could do the scenery. While traveling away across Newfoundland, it was a luxury. Folks admired the bullet when she was in her prime. And you could set your watch by her, for she was right on time. Memories of the new feet bullet rolling slowly down the line. Memories of the new feet bullet, it's forever on my mind. There's few that know the caribou was her official name. Most will fondly think of her as a new feed bullet train. You know she served our province 107 years. And my memories of the bullet bring a few nostalgic tears. Memories of the new feed bullet rolling slowly down the line. Memories of the new feed bullet etched forever on my mind.